now I understand why the girls love to shop Zara. <laughs> Morgan, welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I'm going to be doing a Zara haul. I shopped the summer sale and I got three dresses and a shirt. And I'm also going to be showing you some perfumes I got from them in the past few months and a dress I actually got from them like in 2019. It's like yellow and white gingham, but I've actually never worn it out because I bought it shortly after I had my son and you can check out my labor and delivery story up there. And when I bought it, I felt like I still had a bit of a fupa, like a little pouch. And I was like, oh, when I lose the baby weight completely, I will rock it. But I just was never comfortable enough to wear it, but I think that's bad. I will try it on and you guys can let me know what you think. I might sell it, I might give it out, or I might rock it again, let me know. I'm going to start by showing you the perfume. What do you think of my hat? It's from Primark and I got it like in April, but... I'm wearing it because my sister had like a pop-up for her brand over the weekend and they were selling hats and I've been seeing her and everyone around me wear hats so I'm like, I need to let me wear my own hat today and yeah, laying this hair can be a bit stressful yeah, The first perfume I got from them is super popular I've seen a lot of reviews about it and people go on and on about it that it's like a Baccarat Rouge dupe I really like it This is it I'm a huge fan of it. I think it smells amazing. The battery died as I was filming, so if the frame has shifted in any way, that's why. I was saying that the Red Temptation, which is a dupe of Baccarat Rouge, some people say the longevity is not that great, but I don't mind it. It lasts fairly well on my skin. The second one I got from them is the Subline Epoque. I think it smells amazing as well. I can't really like describe, you know, the fragrance note, but you can read up on it online. I think it smells very like rich and expensive, but I'm going for a serious meeting. This is what I use. This is the box. I'm going to start off with the shirt. That's why I'm wearing denim trousers and a top. So I'm going to start off with the shirt and then I will try on the dresses and you guys let me know what you think, whether you think it's a keep or return and definitely check out my other hauls because I've put up an ASOS haul and a H&M haul this month as well. Sarah. Please let me know what you think of this lighting as well because I keep on playing like with the lighting for each video I filmed in the past month. So I'm using like an LED and a very, very small ring light that I don't think does much. It's like 12 inches and I was gifted it. Usually I have an 18 inch ring light, a really nice big one and some soft boxes. But I left the soft boxes in Lagos and my ring light had to be fixed. But it's currently in London so I'm going to get it I think tomorrow or the day after and I can't wait. My best ever lighting is when I did the video talking about the camera I use which is the Canon M50 and when I was comparing the lenses and all that. So if you're interested in lighting and camera and equipment definitely click on the link above and check out that video. Okay so this is the first item. It's a mustard needle cord shirt with covered buttons. I got it in a size small and it's like tweed material really nice fabric one thing i must say is that zara pieces smell amazing this was what the box looked like like really cute fancy packaging 15 pound 99 for a basic shirt what do you guys think do you think it's worth 15.99 let me know i'm not sure how i feel i love the quality of it because it just feels expensive and i think it can be styled in a variety of ways and also it is my favorite color so i think i am pretty inclined to keep it i feel like it can be worn as a jacket like i can wear this on top of like a white shirt and jeans or with like a black shirt and jeans which is what i'm currently doing or with black and black or with white and white i think it's pretty versatile and the model on the zara website wore with like a white turtleneck top and like black tailored pants like now i understand why people say that zara is slightly higher than h&m just because it feels really amazing like it feels like it will last forever so i was just looking on the zara app and i saw that all the pieces i got for 15.99 were further discounted to 9.99 imagine that's why you have to be wise when shopping and shop at the best time <laughs> 
Okay, let me try on the dresses. So when I ordered this Zara order, it said £3.95 for shipping to my house. And I felt that was a bit expensive because I had just ordered from ASOS where it was £9.99 for next day shipping for a year. So I chose the £1.95 option, which meant they delivered it to my closest post office. But then when I opened the email, I thought it was a further post office. So I took a longer bus ride and then I walked further than I needed to. And then I got there and they were like, oh, it's not here. That multiple post offices in the area have the same name. So I had to go back. So it was just like, double journey and really irritating so I think next time I will just pay for the £3.95 delivery to my home because this dress wasn't worth it. What do you think? Okay, so this next dress is called the midi dress with gathered detail. I got it in a size small and it cost £15.99. Let me know what you think of it. The quality does feel quite nice like the material is really nice. I don't know. I don't know if it's a keep or return. I feel like I'm rediscovering my style after having a child and my tummy not being as flat as it used to be and my boobs being a bit bigger because of breastfeeding and all of that. The model wore it with like a short bob wig and heels. I might actually just turn this camera sideways so you can see how it looks like on the camera, not just on my phone. So I definitely love how it fits on my body. I look snatched. I just wish I paid $9.99 instead of $15.99. So I decided to try on the yellow shirt jacket with the black dress just to test the versatility of it and try and decide if I wanted to keep or return it. So let me know, do you think this yellow shirt is worth $15.99 or not? Do you think it's something that I can find for cheaper elsewhere? This next one is the jacquard belt dress in a medium. I love the print, like I love the color, I love the vibrancy of it red orange like these are these are my colors red orange yellow green those are like some of my favorite colors to wear so i think it's definitely a keep i got a size medium and it was 15.99 i think everything i got was actually 15.99 no the next item was actually 19.99 i understand the zara hype now i actually do be like sun on my skin this is love last item that I got in this haul is the soft high neck dress and I love the color and I like the high neck but the material is knit I thought it was silk like just from the picture I thought it was silk but it's actually like knitwear and I don't need it like in summer I don't need it at all so I'm definitely returning this and one thing I forgot to add about the jacquard dress is that it doesn't have a zip like at least this one has a zip even though the zip doesn't go all the way down but it goes at least to like just below the bra strap but the other one doesn't have a zip at all and i think zips are really useful and this is why i don't wear makeup when i'm filming try on hauls because i don't want to stain anything because it would have been such a hassle to take that off if i had makeup on but yeah i will try on the gingham dress that i told you about that i bought three years ago and you guys can just let me know what you think but i think i'm definitely returning this and now i understand why the girls love to shop Zara. What is your favorite story to shop from? Let me know. And let me know if you can see that there's a difference in the lighting between this video and the other one. It's literally the same lighting I'm using. I'm using it on pure white lights, not a mixture of white and like yellow light. Juices, make sure you hit the subscribe button and check out my other video. I forgot to add that I got this dress in a size medium and I definitely feel like a small or an extra small would have fitted me better. But it's really hot. It's actually really, really hot. You can't wear it in the summer. You can only wear it in winter or maybe autumn. Got some more on my plate. My baby got me looking forward to the end of the day. What you say? You and me. Just forget about the past. Throw it in the trash. What you so this is the gingham dress I was talking about. And it actually looks amazing on me. Like, my tummy doesn't even look that big. I don't know why I was so self-conscious. But I'm just going to show you, like, the full fit. If you didn't know what I'm talking about, that means you didn't watch this video from the beginning. So go and listen to everything. 
because i know you people when you're watching hauls you like to skip just to see what the outfit looks like but yeah watch everything please because it really helps my channel give a thumbs up turn on the notification bell hit the subscribe button if you haven't already one more haul coming up this month at least who knows there might be more Say, you and me. Son on my skin.